Hey everyone, Lewis here for Pixel Surplus, and today we're going to learn how to change the color of any object using Adobe Photoshop. This is a great skill to have in your locker, and the best part is, it's quick and simple to learn. Let's jump straight in. For today's demonstration, I'm going to use this image of an orange BMW that I got from Unsplash. If you'd like to use this image as well, links can be found in the description below. But if you have your own photograph, feel free to use that. Everything I teach today can be applied to your image as well. So first I'm going to begin by opening my image in Adobe Photoshop. Now that I've got my image on my screen, I can begin to change the color. The way that we'll be changing the color of our image are by using hue and saturation adjustment layers. To add an adjustment layer to our image, we're going to head to the top, select layers, new adjustment layer, and choose hue and saturation. You should now see the hue and saturation layer above your image, as well as the hue and saturation panel. It should look something like this. For this demonstration, I'm going to be changing the color of the car. So I'm going to head to the hue and saturation panel and I'm going to change the drop down from masters to yellows. If you're working on your own image, you're going to want to hit the drop down and choose the option that matches the color of your object the best. My car is yellow, so I'll be choosing yellows. Just note that this is a suggestion and we'll be able to fine tune it in just a moment. Now that I've selected yellows from the drop down menu, I'm going to choose the left eyedropper tool and I'm going to take a sample yellow from my car. You should see the color spectrum slightly shift to better match the color of your object. Now that we have all of our settings complete, grab the hue slider and drag around to change the color of your object. You can also grab the lightness and saturation sliders and move those to find the color that best works for you. Pause the video now and have some fun playing around with the awesome color combinations you can create. If you decide that you're not happy with what you've created, you can hit the reset adjustment layer button. It looks like this. Or if you're happy, hit the X in the top of the panel you now have your new colored object. Whilst using the adjustment layer, I've noticed that I've changed the color of the rims as well as the ground and a couple of small details throughout the car. I want all of these elements to match the original image. Thankfully, this is a really easy fix. Click the layer mask thumbnail, hit B on your keyboard to access your brush tool, choose a hard brush, and make sure you're working with black. Now work your way around your image, painting on anything that you don't want your layer adjust to touch. So I'm going to take some time painting over the ground as well as the rims and a few of those small details as well. Feel free to pause here and take all the time you need. And there you have it, how to change the color of any object using Adobe Photoshop. We here at Pixel Surplus want to know what our community think. So head down in the descriptions and tell us if you liked our videos and what you'd like to see from us next. And whilst you're down there, why don't you hit the like, subscribe and notification bell. And whilst you're down there, you'll also find the description with a link to Pixel Surplus. Pixel Surplus is the home to free fonts, textures, mockups, templates and so much more as well as the best font bundles on the internet. Premium fonts at 90% discounts. Get over there now and check it out for yourself. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day everyone.